We will try out this question from May June two thousand twenty. So you have an elastic cord of length of sixteen centimeter, cross section area of two point six times ten to the power of negative six meter square. So this cord is held by two pins and smooth pins. So you have no frictional force between the pins and the and your cords. So there's a distance of eight centimeter apart. As shown in your figure here, eight centimeter B part. So the cord obeys the Hooke's law. So you have a mass of four zero point four kg suspend at the center, and there are some extension. So there is a sixty degree as shown in your figures here. So what is the young modulus of your material? So you are going to calculate. The young modulus. So let's gather of information here. You have your original length, sixteen centimeter. You have your cross sectional area, which is two point zero times ten to the power of negative six meter square. Okay, so you have the extension. So you look at this diagram here. Firstly, you have two eight point zero centimeter, but the new diagram here tell that you have another eight point zero centimeter. So your extension. So let the e to be the extension, is a eight centimeter. Okay, let's look at this diagram here. So we are going to. Calculate the Young modulus. Young modulus equation is force time length divided by your area times extension. So you're going to figure out what is the force acting to this system here. So if we look at the diagram here, so you have the weight of zero point four times nine point eight one here. This is your weight. And you have tension here. So the both tension is to balance the weight. So if you draw a vertical line here, you should have a thirty degree here. You have a thirty degree. So you have to resolve your tension to vertical. So dealing with the forces. So you have T cosine thirty. Plus t cosine thirty to give you zero point four times nine point eight one. So the upward forces should be equal to the downward forces. So you have two t cosine thirty equal to zero point four times nine point eight one, which is your weight. So your t should be equal to zero point four times nine point eight one divided by two cosine thirty. To give you two point two six six newton. So this T here is the force acting to the cords here. So you have all your information here. So now write the equation of Young modulus force times original length divided by the area times your extension. So you have two point two six six times original length is sixteen centimeter divided by the area and your extension. So you should have your answer as two point three times ten to the power of six pascal. Answer is C for this one.